Uh, just someone brought it up in the Discord. Like, where's Fez's Fez? That's a good point. He's not wearing it this tournament. We need to ask him this. Where is his Fez? Oh, no. I do actually remember him asking whether he brought his Fez or not, but he couldn't be bloody bringing it on plane. Okay. Well, should have been wearing it here. Anyway. So we're moving in here. Cannage versus Scarfell right into Battlefield. We're right in. No hand warmers going on here. Yeah. Cannage so far has now taken percent. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Cannage has got some pretty swift peach tech. Like, uh, see some just, like, oh, uh, yeah. float, cancel, like, stuff going on. They're both some pretty fancy players. Both play very, very well. Yeah. And a dash tech. And that fair. Yep. It's crazy. Just looking for that turnip snipe. And he's already taking a lot of the stage away from Scarfell. Cannage has a pretty good lead so far. Uh -huh. It can be turned around at any time, really. It is Fox. For sure. And now it's Fox's turn to kind of keep Carnage in the air. Yep. That fair, of course. That thing is a very, very scary move. Yeah. Just trying to get those uh, down airs. Good shield. But I just keeping Scarfell off stage here. Yeah, totally. <laughs> oh, there we go. I was going to say, I guess that's what you should do most of the time against Fox's side, you seeing yeah. his Fez. And oh, just going deep for that fair. Other players were trying to intercept it. Oh, and the bomb. Oh, but he throws it away. <laughs> yeah, probably not going to risk it. He's the only one at high percent here. Yeah. That's a good shout out, actually. I, usually when I see that happen and I see any Peach player throw the bomb or, like, lightsaber away, I'm just like, what are you doing? But I guess, yeah, because, like, this sense. is the sort of thing where if the bomb gets used against you, you're going to die. Yeah. Meanwhile, Scarf out, not so much. He just take a bit of damage, that's all. Yeah. Scarfell just looking for the kill here, though, so not quite getting it. Kind of just staying safe. Oh, up smash, smash just missing. He jumps away and he goes for the. Maybe expecting the dash attack. He's oh, kind of just letting go of shield there. The ledge front, but gets nothing from it. Oh. <laughs> Going for the side B, not punished. And all it takes is one down air to follow up into up smash oh, yeah. for Scarfell to close this out. Definitely. Kind of just not letting him have it, though. He's playing very, very nice here. Sure. That backer is not quite going to take it. Pretty close. Yeah. Ooh, dash that catching the ledge roll. On the grab? No, yeah. nothing from it. I imagine these players have played each other quite a lot down in London. Mm. I yeah. don't really know what their record versus each other is. Yeah. I'm sure some of the London players in chat could help with that. And they seem pretty familiar. Yeah. Already. I'd imagine so. Kind of just hoping for these turn snipes, not quite getting it though. Of course. Obviously getting nothing from his throws. Yeah, his, his throws just don't really give him anything he needs. You're not killing until like 200%, if not more. The up tilt taking the it flick. there though. Flick of the wrist, That'll flick of the stick. Yeah. Yep. And now, uh, I mean, Kanage has done pretty well to get 69% already on uh, Scarf oh, yeah. here. He's definitely still holding a solid lead here. Yeah. They're just both playing very, very solidly. Let's get him in there. Oh. Scarfell just reading the air dodge there. And again, I can I get a third? Oh, no, it's not high enough. Ah, uh, those back airs. That back air is so swish. Oh, trying to go for the that upside there. Peach is just floating the out <laughs> Nicely done. It seems like such a weird hitbox to try and catch you uh, with the fair, like, from that angle, mm. you know? And... I felt just looking for those up airs, just not quite getting them kind of reacting appropriately. I just kind of wait. Mm. And there we go, is that going to do it? Not quite, Fox is light, but he's just surviving there. We're getting the back air, no, no. Kind of just, oh, oh no. the float runs out. Extended, overextended too yeah. much. Yeah, that's unfortunate for Kanage. But like, it shouldn't be like one, you know, dash well, stack or whatever. Yeah. Should. It just depends how much it might cost him here. Because it depends how long Scarfell stays alive for. Yeah. Get him off the stage. Oh, nope, catching him there. Got him with an air. And the air again. Nair will take it off. Just that float air covers so much of the gap options on stage. Yeah. Go into a roll, Nair. Mm -hmm. You just get up, fair. So we're down to a one stock game now. Kanage is looking pretty solid right now.
Mm, the grab. Catching him there again. again. Yeah, get that interception in. Mm -hmm. And Scarfell just pressuring him out, trying to get him back off stage with... Just that frame data getting in about there. Yeah, too good. Scarfell just trying to bait Kanage into doing something and punish it. Yeah, short hops, getting away from dash stack and whatnot. Just all those all cancels. Like, seeing the all cancel bear into up till is just a scary, scary thing. He doesn't wait for the air dodge that time. He just goes for the up air. Just goes right for it. Again. Oh. Another attempt at it there. Peach trying to read the side B with an up smash there, but a bit too early. Oh, oh the <laughs> collision. That was a weird collision there, yeah. yeah. Both way. Uh, They're both playing very carefully here. They yeah. each kind of know that another solid hit will leave them dead. Oof. Is that going to do it? Ooh, no, he waits for the very dodge, close. but he doesn't get anything. Kind of just trying to get that nair on the side B, but not quite hitting it. Mm -hmm. Oh, the, <laughs> the kick. <laughs> Ta-da. Is that the forward tilt, I think? Yeah, yeah. the up tilt, I think. Um, nah, the up tilt's the... Uh, oh, it might actually be the up tilt. Yeah, You'd be I, th right. I think it was. But it was definitely a weird mix-up. Um, Down there? He's gonna get oh, he's getting yeah. the fair. Good hang off the edge there. Whew. So game one goes to Kanish. Very, very close set. A uh, really, very, very close game. Though. Really tense. Definitely could have gone either way. Things were looking hairy for both at the end there. <laughs> I Kanish like just fanning himself I like the Kanish's fan. fan. <laughs> you got to just stay calm, stay cool. Stay collected. Stay collected. That yeah. fan helps. It does. I'm sure it does. I should get myself a fan. <laughs> and going into game two... Um, Are they going to go back to Battlefield? All right. So, obviously, Scarf Up feeling is a good stage. Yep. Just starting off is much similar as the first game, just sort of spacing each other out, oh trying yeah. to land a solid first hit. Scarf Up not quite managing to confirm off that up tilt there. Yeah, they're just trying to get some stage control going on. It looks like Scarfelt's Ooh. getting in there. Kanish going for the toad. They seem to go for it quite a lot today. Mm. Oftentimes it hasn't hit, but it yeah. does make you aware that... He's not really being punished for it. That's the thing. No, that's true. And you're like, oh, there's a toad. You know, like <laughs> I shouldn't like go into attacks like Willy nilly. Ooh. Good catch of the side B there from Kanish. Is he going to go in? Yep, he's going to just fall with Kanish there. Mm-hmm. Oh, very nice catch with the fair there. He just sees those raw side bees. He's just keeping these side bees out, stopping Scarf from getting back to the stage. Mm -hmm. And again, that was up a nice air. side bee into up tilt. Up tilt, up air. Yeah. <laughs> um. So now, kind of just looking for like a fair. Or just the land, really. <laughs> yeah. He's just kind of looking to get on the ground, you know? Yep. Ooh. Not quite taking it. Battlefield's a big stage. There we go. Hit by the turnip. And... Is he going to try to go for the side again? Ooh. Oh. I was expecting the up smash there, but I suppose he wouldn't quite take it, even with rage. Battlefield's a big, big stage. Yep. And Peach has some weight. Oh. Not for that up air. No, quite Again, catching, though. Fall back, a back air will take it, though. A back air. So good. All right. Put that scarf out right back into it. Already going for those up airs. Again with the flick. Trying to follow him up there. Ooh. And he's just playing it nice and safe. Oh, just ledge guarding him. The up tilt's gonna knock him into the sky, though. Mm. Nice wee nair there, like soft hit. Oh nice yeah. Grab. And again, he's not falling for the pressure of these back airs. He's mm -hmm. just kind of staying in shield. Cause why not? Oh yeah. Like the thing is, Fox can't really do much to your shield. You can definitely pressure it, but you're not gonna get killed off a yeah. shield very easily against Fox. Yeah. He has no kill throw or kill setups to speak of <sighs> from throws. Oh, fair almost did it. Ooh, that fair very nearly took yeah. it there. Oh, that was that a footstool? Yeah. Yep. 
And now it kind of just got control of the stage. Even though he's sitting at a Ooh. pretty high deficit. Uh, He's definitely brought it back quite a lot here, though. Yep. He's very nearly a Max Rage as well. And Max Rage Peach, I mean, that's forward air scares me enough already. Yeah. Garfield just trying to get uh, his cannage to go for something here so you can kill him. Mm -hmm. Just fishing for these back airs. Yep. The patented Tesla back air. Short up on the spot. Yep. No catch of the back air, just keeping Scarfa off the stage oh, here. Oh, there's the dash oh. attack. And a dash attack, already scary as is, but with Cannage at 160, 170% oh. here. The sour spot forward smash kills. <laughs> back of the net. <laughs> Sent horizontally and that still takes it out. What a weird direction. Oh, yeah. So now these two are playing down our battles. Down to the wire now. Yeah. We're back to how we were in the first game, eight. Oh, Cannage running into the yeah. uh, jab there. Tries to anticipate yeah, ending early. <laughs> Ooh. And yeah, you can pretty much just do down air with uh, into up tilt with Fox there, as you saw there. It's just like it's pretty, it's pretty safe. Yeah. Pretty safe. Catching a side B with the uh, dash attack there. Oh, oh, there he go. waits. Yeah, it's like you got, not falling for that again. Just interrupting all these side B's with the forward air. Yeah. Oh. Ooh. Literally like being hit by a freight train. Yep. Oh, that was interesting. And he's going to get it. Good Very tag. nice tag from uh, Scarfelt. Oh, and he anticipates the fall through the platform. Ooh. And the up smash. Oh, and the up smash takes it there. Peach is light enough for that to work. Okay, we're going to game three. That DI was maybe a bit questionable there. I didn't see the red sparks. That's true. That kind of... Yeah. Oh, yeah. I was like, could you anticipate that? All right, so we're up 1-1 one, one at the moment. Yep. Are we going back to Battlefield? <laughs> I don't think it was proving like nah. too bad for either. All right, player. we're going to Palutena's. Fair enough. All right. So we're down to the last game here. Yep. This is match point. One of this advances into winner's finals, I believe. Oh, my God. <laughs> And they'll be up against the winner of Magi Magi and uh, Mint. Okay, so still some tough times ahead. Mm -hmm. um, of course, our boy Fez is in the winner's is there. He's coming right back. <laughs> yeah, you just watch. Watch the space. Um, All right, so we're down to 45-45 each here at the start. Again, <laughs> like really even. Definitely. There's no one really pulling that far ahead here. And even if they do pull far ahead, they generally bring it back fairly mm -hmm. solidly and in a quick enough time. Yeah, the skill gap is like pretty much just on a level oh playing yeah. field. They're both very, very good players. Yeah. Oh, sniped with the turnip. Caught him even, I can't even speak. And uh, <laughs> he goes, doesn't go for the up air there. That dash deck, not gonna quite take it. It's strong, but not that strong. Double slap. Can I get that? No. Little whack to the face. Yep. Get off me. Just spacing each other out a wee bit here. Again, nope. That down here, that drill into up smash. Sort of terrifying like thing. And in turn, Cannon Jancher is right back saying, get like off my stage. <laughs> yeah, you know what? He's not having any of that. Yeah. Oh, good. good nice spacing. bait there. Just walk away, punish. Knows when the dash attack's going to end. Cannon's pulling ahead quite solidly here, though. Have I jinxed it? <laughs> <laughs> Watch this turn around incredibly fast. And again for the side B. Ooh. Oh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Is that fair? Oh, yeah. Um. Ooh. Oh. Both catching the side B there. Good timing on the nair there. Uh, nice down tilt. And that bear's going to take it. But... Kind of just challenging pretty right quite now. a solid lead here. <laughs> mm. uh, oh, <laughs> oh, that was a nice sweet pivot. 
Absolutely. Oh boy. Scarpa answering back in his own here, saying that this is not over yet. Yeah. Just racking up that percent, seeing if he can close this stock quickly. Well, that up here, you gotta be careful. Mm -hmm. He's definitely looking for it. Ooh, a drill into the up. Yeah, turn around up tilt. If he manages to land an up smash here, he's in a really good spot. Yeah, sure. And he's using more lasers this game. Mm. He hasn't really been using them the last two, but it's like in his last game with Fez, like, you know, he just suddenly uses them. Ooh, nearly there. Here's what just he's keeping Kanage off stage. I'm looking to see. And that back here is going to take him. We're down to an even game again. So now this is the third game we've gone down to one stock at yeah. 11%. Because <coughs> even when the one or the other gets the lead, the other always brings it back, bringing us these really close cool sets. Yeah. So who's going to have this? Ireland or England? What's well, us up? Again with these lasers, and the gap is closing. Oh yeah, Scarfelt just playing safe here. Both not committing to anything too much. Yep. Yeah, he's trying to go for some rogue side bees and hope that he catches Carnage off guard. Mm -hmm. Like there. <laughs> Oh. 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 oh! oh! Flashbacks. Flashy finish by Scarf out there with Ireland taking it over England. We have a new Larry. Oh boy. Irish Larry. I've seen him attempt it a few times today, but I think it's the first time I've seen him kill with that and with such a pivotal stock as well. <laughs> Damn. Oh. Kind of looking a bit Canada's defeated there. I look happy about that. I don't think anyone was expecting that. No, that came out of nowhere, but it was definitely a good, good kill. Ooh. Just that impending.